Hello everybody, this is Aquatini and we are back with Sims 2 Mega Hood. This is round 11, part 15 of the Stax family in Belladonna Cove. Now Jane Stax is engaged to Castronova who just graduated from uni. They are planning to have a wedding. Now I put in a community wedding lot, but if I do that, I can't I don't think I can throw a wedding party at a community lot. Maybe I can and I don't know how. I'm not sure. But I know I can get them married there <clears throat> on the community lot. So we might do that. But we'd have to do it after 6 p.m. Because that's when he can come back. Otherwise, we could throw a wedding party here and get married... Does the baby need... Oh, the baby's asleep. Um, and get married here, like, in the apartment? Or are out here on the balcony? Which would be very tight. It would be a very tight space. But then I know that we could have a wedding party. Um... Oh, I've got recolors. When did I get recolors? Oh. Oh, that's pretty. But honestly, the red just... Y'all think that would work okay? Just have them get married like right there. And then a couple of guests could stand and watch if they wanted. We wouldn't have that many guests. I think it'll be fine. Okay, you're getting up and coming downstairs to clean something. Okay, sure. Sure, that's, that's fine. We'll get you to use the bathroom and clean. And clean. Yeah, we'll do some cleaning today. Oh, we have bills to pay. Do you know Miranda? She's walking by. Oh, you do know Miranda. We should greet Miranda. Don't go anywhere, Miranda. Seriously, don't go anywhere. I'm going to greet you. We're friends. And I should greet my friends. But I really need to clean my bathroom. You understand, I'm having a wedding. We will have to take care of the baby in a little bit, but... Hey, Jasmine. You're also in love with Reuben? You need to call it off with Reuben. You are a family, Sam. Call Sam. Let's call... Let's call Martin and break up. Let's just... Let's just call Martin. Get him to come over and then tell him that... We are engaged to, and we're going to marry someone else. And, and we, we are not interested in him any longer. We just want to be friends. So that's what we'll do. We'll ask him to just be our friend. And then we'll go take care of our baby. Oh, Harry Ma hey Mary Gavigan. Sure, we'll greet you. You're standing here. Why not? Oh, because you're a little bit of a snob. Look, I'm not going out of my way to greet you. If you won't let me greet you, then you won't let me greet you. <sighs> Great Martin. Don't kiss him. I said don't kiss him. Ask to just be friends. Thank you. Now let's go see about our baby. Our baby's still asleep. Alright, all is good in the universe. 
Do we need anything? No, we're good. You two can be good friends, and he can just... Yep, just good friends. Okay, now the baby's awake. All right, Imogene, I'm coming. What does your lifetime want? Three kids from college. All right, very doable. He's playing in the leaves. Alright, sure. He's a grown man. Playing in the leaves, that's perfectly acceptable. <sighs> Monica, you're always so mad. <sighs> oh, baby Imogene. Give her a nice cuddle. And then we gotta take her upstairs and put her back to sleep. She doesn't age up this round, does she? And then we gotta bang on the wall. Um, let's see. Where is my... <laughs> Negahood, here we go. Oh God, the baby ages up today. In the middle of the wedding, the baby is gonna age up. Or right before the wedding, the baby is gonna age up. That's awkward. Okay, is there any leftovers? Here, go get a left. Don't you pick that baby up. spaghetti for lunch is it Melody Tinker does she live here now she might because there are four college kids living here now so it might be Melody Tinker is the fourth one if she lives here she lives here could be Melody Tinker or she could just be walking by I do not know and then Chaz is walking by. Tell you what we'll do. We'll get married first. And then after we're married, we'll worry about aging our daughter up. And then we can worry about, well, we can't even make smart milk until after we get married. Then we'll worry about all the other things. Are you friends with Angela? Somebody needs to be friends with Angela. Angela doesn't have enough friends. And she's kind of hanging in limbo. It's kind of... people plenty of people are going to be here for our wedding uh, 
Most of them we don't even know, really, but that's fine. What time should we throw the wedding? At five or at four? Well, by the time she gets here and we actually do it, that'll be the perfect time. Where's our phone? Do we not have a phone in our house? You have to have a phone, a landline phone to throw a party for some reason. What am I looking for? All right, come over here. Let's throw a party. Let's throw a wedding party. Let's see. We want caster. Um, Keisha and Hermia, Juliet, like or Stella. We'll do the co all the college kids, sort of. We'll try that. You're not really friends with Jules or Mackie. And the other people are just kind of hanging out. That's more than enough. Oh, you want to get to be friends. Who is this? Oh, he's just a teenage kid. Oh, you're going to come play chess. <sighs> and everybody's showing up in wedding dresses. Oh, Lord. Everybody's showing up in wedding dresses. Um, come answer the phone. And I didn't even adjust her clothes, so I have no idea what she's got set for formal. Uh, Professor, I really don't know. That's really sweet of you to call, but now's not a good time. She wants to befriend Angela and befriend Sarah. Please don't. Let's talk to Angela. Let's let's just try to befriend Angela for a little bit, and then we'll do the wedding. Yep, it's Emma Jean's birthday and it's 6 p.m. so we can get we can get married now. Is everybody having a congestion by the door? Oh wow, she's got on a an uh, old timey green dress. It's pretty. It's pretty. Um Okay. Uh, the groom needs to be able to get over here. Um, uh, Castor? There you go. I don't care if the rest of you can make it in or not, but I need the groom. Oh, wow. Castor. 
Well, it's a look. It's definitely a look. But that's fine. It's fine. As long as they're happy, that's all that matters. Oh, and I haven't bought a wedding cake yet. How is he marrying a wealthy Sam? I don't know. Oh, and I haven't paid the bills. We're going to take, yeah, we're going to take his last name. She immediately wants a baby. Uh, of course she does. Okay, um, let's get a wedding cake. Um, this pale one, maybe? And then we'll try to cut it. If we can get through. If we can get through. Do I need to move people? I probably need to move some people. Um, excuse me. Excuse you. You just got married, dude. And she is married. So you two stop it. And we have a daughter upstairs that we've got to age up. What is his? Um, oh, he wants to be a world-class ballet dancer. All right, wedding cake for everybody. If you want it. You don't have to have it. But, you know. I'm gonna go ahead and sell that real quick. Oh, she's got a point. I'll give her that. And he's got a point. I'll give him that. And the baby needs to be edged up. Uh-uh. Do you have a... What kind of relationship do you have with her? None. You do not have a romantic relationship with her. No. You can go upstairs and you can age up your daughter. You stay away from Allegra. No, I'm not going to be made out with. I just got married. Allegra, stop it. Oh, the baby's asleep. Is there a bathroom upstairs? Oh, there is a bathroom with a tub upstairs. Um, why don't you go ahead and take a shower, even though we're still in the middle of the wedding. It'll be fine. It'll keep you out of trouble. Allegra, take a hint. Mm. 
Where the hell did Ledbrook go? Okay, she went outside. Good. Is the baby up yet? No, the baby is still sleeping. Do we have an ACR? Not ACR. Um, no, it doesn't look like we do. I'm going to block off this wardrobe and put a sim blender right here. You can do some wedding kicky bag. That's fine. I'm not sure where you're wanting to do wedding kicky bag, but right in the way, but that's fine. Okay, now the baby's crying. Okay, come change your machine diaper. I actually do this for me. Come use the bathroom and change Imogene's diaper. Listen to complaint. Oh my god. It's a roof razor. What, Jasmine? Uh. Sounds like a personal problem to me. Oh, actually, I need you to make me... Um, could you clean up, clean up, clean up, um, clean up, clean up. You did not go to the bathroom like I asked you to. Put Imogene in a crib and get over here and use this bathroom. You need to use the bathroom first because then you're going to have to do stuff with your baby. I got Castro doing some cleaning. Oh, wow, that was something. Okay, Imogene has edged up. Let's find her on the spreadsheet. And let me change some things on the spreadsheet. You are Jane Stacks no more. You are now Nova. And going forward, this is going to be the Nova house. And I've got this in wrong. Caster. Okay. So your daughter is a toddler. And she is a Pisces. Which is what? Knowledge? Am I right on that? Knowledge. Okay. Very good, very good, very good. She wants a toy, which, yeah, she needs a toy. Do we want to get a smart milk thing upstairs? Probably. It'll save us a lot of hassle if we just hmm. 
Um, let's get a... She's got the blue. So we're doing sort of blue. Blue and yellow. We'll go with that. And we'll get you a potty. Put it right there. We'll get you a rabbit. And one of these. And then this will have to go... Right there and hope it works. Um... And then mom can get this. And mom can make you a smart milk. And then you want to learn how to walk. Okay. Mom. You hold out for that bottle, babe. No, hold out for the bottle. Ugh, I hate winter. Here, drink this bottle. And then we'll get somebody teaching you your stuff. Mom! Jane! Talk to Imogene. Snuggle. Family kiss. I'm going to get your dad up here. And we'll see if your dad can teach you to walk. Because your mom has abandoned you. Those two do not match. This is blue stars and this is... Something else entirely. I needed to get it to the point that he can actually. Uh, snuggle. Um, teach her to walk. Receive noise complaint. Honey's. Oh, wow. have anything interesting in his pockets? No. No, he doesn't. Okay. And you're going downstairs to clean up. Okay. We need to at least get her one thing and then you can, oh, we're going to have to put her on the potty and then you can do the rest later and then you two can go have your honeymoon or what have you. And I need to see about getting you a job in the dance field if we can find it. And you want to get a ballet bar, which actually works for you, but I don't know where we would put it. We 
We could put it right there, I guess. Is she down here sleeping? bookcase we don't have a bookcase no we don't have a bookcase um okay where's your bookcase all right now i need you to put her on the potty. She learned how to walk, put her on the potty, and then she can go from there. And then you can get yourself up from your nap. Upstairs. You just got married. All right, now she can play. Now it's time for you to play, Imogene. Because Mom and Daddy are going to go do their own playing. You don't want to play with your toys? Seriously? You don't want to play with your toy? You want to go to bed? Okay, you do want to play with your toys. Okay, good, good. Yeah, I figured that was coming. All right. On that note, let's end this part right here. So thank you so very much for watching my video. Goodbye for now.